Hi, I'm Miss Huffman. And I'm Miss B. Welcome to Two, Two Teachers, Teachers, a place where we can read and learn together. Today, we will be reading We Are in a Book. Oh, hold on. I don't think you're holding the book the right way. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. We're going to read We Are in a Book. Wait, try this. Oh, you know, that does make a lot more sense because this way I can read the words left to right and the spine is on the left and the book opens this way. Thanks, Miss B. Anytime. <laughs> like I said, we are going to read the book, We Are In A Book, written and illustrated by Mo Willems. And as we read, I want you to think about what makes a book, a book. We are in a book. Now, the first thing that I noticed is this has the same words as we read on the front. That's because this is the front cover, which often has the title, and sometimes it has information like who wrote the book, that's called the author, and who drew the pictures, that's called the illustrator. You'll also find this information on the spine of the book, and it says Willems, that's the author and illustrator. One person wrote the words and drew the pictures. It also says an elephant and piggy book because there are many more in this series. And it tells you the title, We Are In A Book. Now this book has a hard cover and you might be able to tell, you can certainly hear it. The front cover, the spine, and the back cover are all hard. But when you open it up, this is what we call a title page. It says the title again, and it often tells you who wrote and illustrated the book. But, I'm kind of having trouble finding that part. Hmm. Do you see it? I think it's supposed to be right about here. Oh, right. By Mo Willems. This must say by Mo Willems. I wouldn't have known that if I hadn't have looked at the spine to see that Mo Willems wrote and illustrated this book. Huh. I guess they really are in the book. Yeah. Thank you. Wait, hmm. why did Piggy... Did you do something? I didn't do anything. Did you do anything? No. We did just start the first page, right? We just turned to the first page. Yeah. Well, let's keep reading. Hmm? This speech bubble has an exclamation mark. An exclamation mark means the character is feeling some strong feelings. And in this case, Elephant is feeling surprised. Here's my surprise face. Here's Gerald's surprise face. What's your surprise face, Miss B? What's your surprise face? It's a good one. Piggy! Yes, Gerald? I think someone is looking at us. Hmm. Hmm. Someone is looking at us. Who is looking at us? A monster? No, it is... A reader! A reader is reading us! Oh, that's we're us. The reader. Yeah, yeah, we're the readers. And oh, that's you too. We're looking at them. How is the reader reading us? The reader is reading these word bubbles. Yeah. We are in a book. Hey, that's the title. Yeah. We are in a book? That is so cool! Wow, now these words go from the left side of the page all the way to the right side of the page and are written really big. So I know the author wants us to use our loud and proud voices. That is so cool! Oh, and look how the illustrator, same person, Mo Willems, showed what's going on in the pages. Can wow. you help us decide what's going on with the illustration? Yeah, it looks like Piggy was jumping from the left to the right. We are in a book, we are in a book, we are being read, we are being read. Oh, I have a good idea. I can make the reader say a word.
you can make the reader say a word? You can, if the reader reads out loud. That is a good idea. That is a funny idea. Here I go. <laughs> Banana. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> the reader said. <laughs> Okay, there's a lot of words to read on this page. Can you help me read some of these words? Yes. Will you help me read some of them too? Okay, there's a lot of words that say ha 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 and a lot that say he he he. So which do you want to read? I'll do the he. Okay, you'll do the he, I'll do the ha. You choose what you wanna do at home. And we're gonna start at the top and try to read all of them until we work our way down to the bottom. Okay, you ready? Okay, go. <laughs> I think I still need some help reading. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Banana, so funny. Do you want to turn before the book ends? Ends? The book ends? Yes, all books end. When will the book end? I will look. Oh, check it out. What's what's going on here? What is Piggy doing? He's lifting up the pages to get to the very last page. Oh. Let's see if we can do that too. So I'll do what Piggy is doing in this book. I'm lifting up the pages and I'm trying to find the very last page because that should show us when the book ends, when it runs out of pages. Oh, did you see that? Yeah, the numbers match. The numbers match, a five and a seven. 57, page 57. <laughs> page 57, it is page 46 now. What, how does, how does Elephant know that? Whoa, well, the page number right here. Oh, right. 46. That matches. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now it's page 47. So it seems that Elephant, or Gerald, knows something about books, right? He knows that books go from left to right and the words on the page match the page numbers. Now, not all books have page numbers, but it looks like this one does. This book is going too fast. I have more to give. More words, more jokes, more bananas. Oh, did you notice the difference in these words? Much smaller. Much smaller. So I should use my much smaller voice. I just want to be read. I have a good idea. Whisper, 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 whisper. That is a good idea. Hello, will you please read us again? I hope this works. Me too. <laughs> wow, so it seems that Elephant and Piggy know a lot about books, don't they? Mm-hmm. It seems that they knew that we have title pages and they can stand in front of the author or the illustrator, in this case, Mo Willem's name. And what else did we learn? We know that we go from left to right. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. And that books have words. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Not all books. Some books are just pictures or yeah. illustrations. That's but true have words and page numbers. Oh yeah. Oh, and a really important part of a book, books usually have readers. Yeah, yeah. me, you, yeah. and you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
And Gerald found out maybe the hard way that all books end. Hmm? Yeah. But it seems that they tried to solve this problem. Do you remember how they solved the problem? Yeah, by asking us to read it again. Yeah. So maybe if you can find your own copy of We Are In A Book, written and illustrated by Mo Willems, maybe you can try to read it again. And perhaps you can solve one more mystery that we didn't solve today. Why is Piggy saying thank you here at the beginning? I don't know. Well, again, I hope you can grab your own copy of We Are In A Book by Mo Willems, right, and enjoy reading too. Until next time, bye. bye.